Hello everybody, my name is Nadia and I'm living in Japan. Today we are in my kitchen because I want to make some gyozas. I actually made some gyozas for the New Year celebration and I use this recipe. Um, gyozas are typically made from meat and or seaweed. Seaweed? No, seafood. Gyozas are typically made from meat and or seaweed. They're filled with meat and or seafood. seafood? Oh my gosh, I can't say seafood. So typically, gyozas are made out of um, meat and or seafood, but today we are making some veggie versions. And to make the gyozas, we first need cabbage, leftover carrot, garlic, and some ginger. Carrots on the floor. Oops, sorry, carrot. Shiitake mushrooms. Tofu. This is nila in Japanese, and this, I believe, is garlic chives. To then wrap our gyoza filling, we need this gyoza skin. For New Year's, I actually did make them myself, um, but it's a little bit time consuming, and I made the wrappers too big, so I ended up having these massive gyozas. So I thought, to cut myself some time and make it easier, I will buy some shop-bought ones. So these are gyoza wrappers from the shop, and this is made from mochi uh, gome, which is mochi rice. So that means that it should be chewy and have a nice texture to them. Let's get making. Mm -hmm. Because I'm lazy, we're going to shred the cabbage in this. Um, yeah, we'll do that. How do you go in? Lock you in. Where is the burgers up there? How do we? How does this work? What? What does that mean? Okay. Wow, this is very close. Slight change of plans. My um, vegetable, what do you call it? This isn't working. So we are going to have to hand cut everything. I think I got it to work. Take two. So this is what half a cabbage will give you. What we want to do is sprinkle some salt on here to try and get all the water out. And then we'll just put that to one side. Do I mix that? We'll leave it. Next we're going to peel our car carrot and cut it into small little itty bitty bits. So this is how my dad was cutting the carrots on New Year's, um, when we made the gyozas for New Year's celebration. And I was like, what a genius idea. I've never seen it like this. So you just cut along, probably thinner strips than what I'm doing right now. But you cut the carrots so much quicker doing it this way. And then we just cut them into smaller chunks. Okay, so this is very 
much bigger than how my dad did it but you want to make them as small or as big as you want I would ideally like smaller but I can't seem to do that <laughs> hmm do I put it in the blender would that be better I might put it in the blender so I wasn't liking how chunky my carrots were so I'm gonna see if I can put it in the blender and not make them go into mush oh my gosh I'm making a mess All right, let's start with a small amount. Let's see. Just, just a quick. Okay, this is much better. That's much nicer, finer bits of grated carrot. Grated carrot, cut carrot. Chunky bits left over birthday again. Oh my gosh. It's raining carrots. Hallelujah, it's raining carrots. So I've done the carrots, I've done the cabbage. What's next? Mushrooms? You know what? I think I might just shove everything in the blender thing. Or is that. No, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. I like the texture of mush these mushrooms, so I am going to cut them so they're a bit chunky and have that juicy texture. Camera. Camera. Now we do the ginger and the garlic. Last time I used about three bits of garlic, but I might add a few more in because I do love garlic. I'm gonna put them in the blender again. Just shove everything in the blender. Okay, so I'm gonna put four bits of garlic in there and then I'm going to just cut a bit of ginger off. I'm just gonna shove the whole thing in and blend that up. Ooh, lovely. Oh, I wish smell of vision was a thing because this smells beautiful. I'm just gonna shove my garlic and ginger mixture in with my mushrooms. I think last but not least is the tofu. So if I remember correctly, last time we used only half of these. And we're just going to roughly chop them up. So these are all the veg that we've just prepared. We've got the cabbage. Nila, tofu, mushroom, garlic, and um, ginger, and then some carrots. This has been, the cabbage has been sitting while um, I've been cutting the other vegetables. So I'm just gonna drain them out, and drain all the water, and then we can get mixing. We've now taken all the water out of the cabbage, so it won't be so wet and soggy when we cook it. And now we are going to mix everything together and add the flavouring. Probably needed a bigger bowl. Two tablespoons of soy sauce. One tablespoon of miso. Two tablespoons of sesame oil. and then salt and pepper to your taste. And we're just gonna mix them all in. I'm gonna need a bigger bowl. One moment. Let's just transfer. It smells so good. 
This is what it looks like. Make sure everything's all mixed in together. Spoon, what the spoon? Then, what? Okay. 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 So, first, how do you do it? Yeah. This is what you do. Yeah. This is what you do. Spoon, you use? Yeah, use. まさか点でもやらないで。<笑>どっちでもいいけど、どのくらい入れる方がいい？そんなに入れても間だから。うん。これやれるくらいでいいんじゃねえの？うん。もう少し入れてみか。もう少し。あんまり入れてもな、本当。いいか。うんいいよ。なんでもいいよ。そして、最初真ん中ペタンコ。どこでもいいんだよね。どこでもいい。あ、お水、お水。あ、水つけたほうがいいか。そう。もうね、パカッと揚げ終わったね。あ、どう？そんなに上手、おたく上手だよ。そう、そんなに上手じゃない。一つ作りました。後で一緒に食べる。食べる。ああよかった。一つババできました。なんだか。一枚二枚かな。あ二枚。これもそうかな。うん。不足。いいよこれ。はい。一枚。熱い<笑>こっち。熱いよね。ああけど作ったこと初めてだ。えー、小さい私小さい時一緒にやったよ。忘れちゃったの？つくだいが<笑>？うん大丈夫だよ。それ大丈夫と思うけど。大丈夫かな。もっと入れてもいいよ。ね、うん。そうと思うと入れていいよ。結構あるじゃんこれか。でもあんまり入れても今度広がってな。うん。ちゃんと破裂する。餃子なか皮二十個あるからね。十個ずつ。いい？<笑>やってもいい？作れるかな。作れるかな。小さい時、パパは家族と一緒に餃子作った？作ったことあるよ。うん、そうと思ったよ。はい、これもう一つやだやった。どうかな？ちょっと小さいよね。大丈夫じゃない？大丈夫？じゃあ、okay. This is much easier. マガジョニー見てるのやり方が見たい。<笑>パパ上手だから。いやあ下手下手。下手じゃないよ、ね。私私そんな作らないよこれ。何何入れたの？私ね肉食べないから。えっと野菜だけ。そう野菜だけ。椎茸、うん、豆腐。肉辛いか。うん。人参あとなんだっけ。ニラニラも入ってる、うん。どんな肉でも辛い。うん食べない。うん。<笑>あとここ水あるよ。うん二枚になってたよね。一、うん、枚です。はい一緒にやってくれてありがとう。うん、でもこれちょっとギベが。うん。ね。ラップ今ラップかける私。いいよ私やるよ。あれなんだっけ。なんかさ水入れ物変える。あー、オッケー、ね、いいよ。うん。ありがとうねババ。うん。うん
パパ若い時毎日料理作ったの、ま、毎日えー、そうなんだかわいそうなんだ大工さんのまかなしてたからあそうか、うん、誰でも手伝いしなかった手伝い誰でも手伝いしてなかったしたけどなこれ忘れた男の子5人だから手伝いしたかなあうちでかそうそうそう後ろ引くと上手だったやつよねあそう、うんあと他の子方なんだろう。昔のこと忘れて。忘れちゃった。あ、いいよ、大丈夫。So we've got this much gyoza filling and we were able to make 20 gyozas. Didn't really think about the gyoza skin to gyoza filling ratio, but that's okay. I can go, go back to the shops and buy some more gyoza skins. And I'm now going to fry them and show you what they look like. Started with, but I think I put too much filling in and didn't do enough bowls. And these are the ones where I put slightly less in, and I think they look a bit, bit nicer, a bit prettier. So, yes, don't put as much in. パパ見て餃子作ったよ。あらあらあらどう？あ美味しそう。美味しそうだよね。うん。うん、あ良かった。作った作った。うん、そうそう作った。すごい。自分で作ったの。Hindsight is truly a wonderful thing. If only I could relive my time in Japan and hold on to more memories from my childhood. When I do think about my childhood, I have so many wonderful memories, and some of the stronger ones are times I spent with my Baba and Gigi. My Baba is a kind and generous lady who's always trying to make sure everybody's fed and as comfortable as possible. I'm so thankful I have these memories, but I feel a little bit sad that I don't get to know her as an adult. She doesn't remember a lot of things these days, and I would have had so many different questions to ask and things I would like to have known and be taught from her. So, this is just a reminder to live in the moment, appreciate the small things, and hug your loved ones a little bit tighter. Ciao, m a t a n e Bye!